you don't put yourself in position where uh, you know you you minimize the uh, the contacts that you make, so that that matter of trust doesn't come up. That's another movie I, I look at all the time. It's an old movie, and it's considered the second greatest movie ever made. A lot of people say they don't see how that ever came to be, but I can see how it came to be. It's called Casablanca, with Humphrey Bogart playing the part of a character called Rick Blaine. Now, uh, I, I say that everybody should be codified, and I use, and people can look at the movie, and just watch the way that Rick Blaine, the cafe owner in that movie, Casablanca, goes about doing things. Mm -hmm. For one thing, he doesn't really trust anybody because he knows that he's not in a position where people can be trusted. Mm -hmm. See, in the system of white supremacy, you you just make do, really. You're in a prison system. So what do you do in a prison system? Who can you trust in a prison system? And you look at the whole world as a prison. You look at the system of white supremacy as a prison. So whom can you trust in the prison? Well, you minimize putting yourself in a position where you have to trust anybody, even though you know you have to trust quite a few people. You have to trust the person, you know, who serves you uh, in, the, in the mess hall, in, in, the, in the kitchen and whatnot. You have to trust that the people of, you know, not poisoning the food and all like that. As in the movie, a prison movie, Shawshank Redemption, and the frame went to lunch. His first lunch had a worm in it. I mean, you know, and so, hey, prison conditions, I mean, you just might have worms in your food. Or poison, and a lot of the food is poisoned in the system of white supremacy deliberately. And a lot of things that are called food isn't really even food. Yes, sir. It's just a lot of plastic. Mm -hmm. And you're eating plastic. But whom do you trust? So you have to trust people because you're in a prison system. But you minimize putting yourself in a position where you extend your situation where the trust you, you have to trust more and more and more people. Going back to the movie here again, Casablanca, Rick Blaine knew that everybody who approached him had some type of game. People who are supposed to be friends, people who he, who he knew were declared enemies. But he couldn't really trust anybody, even though he had to trust quite a few people. But he only did it when he had to. And so in answer to your question, in the system of white supremacy, you only do it when you absolutely have to, because you're going to have to trust somebody. When you go to the hospital, you trust whatever <laughs> whatever people are going to be the attendants to you. Yeah, you trust that when they put that needle in your arm, that they are putting in the correct substance, that they are not getting you addicted to something or something like that. You yeah. trust that. You don't have any idea what this is. Mm -hmm. See, and somebody who has it in for you can very easily switch syringes or whatnot yes and, and ruin your entire existence yes all right so but this is the way you do it 